calm down, conspiracy nut, Joe Biden told us recently. My disinformation board is going to focus on foreign sources of disinformation. It's not aimed at the domestic population. Well, thank heaven for Senator Josh Hawley, because he just got whistleblower documents showing that is, of course, a total lie. The memos Hawley obtained showed the board was created in part to monitor domestic speech, conspiracy theories about the validity and security of elections and COVID vaccines. <laughs> if you question the COVID vaccines, right, you need to be monitored. The board was also working on a partnership with Twitter to suppress unauthorized opinions of many stripes. Josh Hawley is, of course, a senator from Missouri. He joins us tonight with these documents. Senator, thanks so much for coming in and for doing this. So this was aimed, tell me if I'm mischaracterizing this, at our population. Yeah, that's exactly right. As it turns out, Tucker, the people that the Biden administration thinks are the real threat to America, it's not the drug cartels, it's not foreign threats. It, it's you. It's the American people. Yeah. If you have questions about COVID, if you have questions about COVID masks, if you have, if you have questions about the COVID vaccine, this administration wanted you to be monitored. This disinformation board was set up to go after you. That's what the documents say. By the way, election integrity, same story. The documents specifically mention that they needed to be a disinformation board because some people were having questions about election integrity. Some people had questions about January 6th. Well, we couldn't have that. And this board was set up to monitor that. That was what was in their sights. And I tell you, Tucker, it, it just gives the lie to what they were saying in public. So the federal government partnering with private companies to censor Americans who criticize Pfizer is unconstitutional, isn't it? Yeah, you would sure think so. I mean, this idea that the government is going to stand up an institution that's going to monitor American speech, that's going to treat Americans' political speech, Tucker, core political speech about political issues as something that needs to be monitored, that needs to be countered. This was going to be a, a state propaganda machine. This board was supposed to push out counter information to Americans who are raising questions, and yes, to partner with big tech. The whole idea here in the documents show this is that the government would get together with big tech and collect information on Americans who were raising these questions. I mean, how dare you? That's the whole idea here, is that the government and big tech, these companies would partner together in this massive censorship campaign. It is truly, truly chilling. It's, it's beyond belief. And thank you for proving what everyone suspected um, beyond a shadow of a doubt. Senator Josh Hawley of Missouri, thank you. Thank you. So the CIA is spying on you, maybe reading your texts. That's illegal, but don't worry because they're celebrating Pride Month. We have the documents.